Hey dog, what you got there? Check out this week's haul. So, I got some. I got some great books. I got some great books here today. This is the New Mutants number seven. This is the. Uh, if you watch any of the recent podcasts, you know I'm a huge uh, magic fan. And this is uh, the series that she was introduced in, the New Mutants. And so I haven't read this. I don't know what this is about. I just thought it was really cool. Um, it wasn't too expensive, so I said, "Let me let me snag that up." Then I got uh, Iron Man number two ninety four. This is uh, him fighting Technovore. Uh, not a lot of people She's super into Iron Man, but I like I like the color I th cover. I like the cover. I thought the cover was cool. I don't. Know, I like the color of the cover too. I thought the cover was cool, so I wanted to get that. And then lately, I've been uh, really been on a Wolverine kick. So I've got several, I've got a whole a stack of Wolverines here, a full run. Well, not a full run, but consecutives. i got Wolverine number 73, where he's fighting some sort of creature. I haven't read that. Wolverine number 74, where he's uh, saving Jubilee from the here, Sentinel. And then i got Wolverine number 75. This is the Fatal Attraction storyline. I think this is the issue, Rick was telling me, right after. Because it's, it's part of the storyline where, in this storyline... Magneto pulls all of the adamantium off of Wolverine's uh, bone, out of the skeleton. And he kind of goes into Savage Wolverine where he loses his nose, basically. <laughs> and he gets the bone claws that you've seen in the movies. And this is just, this is right after that occurs. I think this is the aftermath and you can just see, oh, you look at the back there, he's just, I mean, he is in some serious pain. And he's just being pulled apart here. And then, Wolverine number 76, which is kind of following that, you got a, uh, is her name Deathstrike? I, can't, I think it's Deathstrike. Yeah, she's got the weird, the weird hands. Wolverine number seventy-seven with the bone claws, and uh, Wolverine number seventy-eight. This I haven't, you know, haven't read this one, so I don't know what this is about. I'm gonna read this whole run, and then, of course, listen. I can't go, listen, drink. I can't go to a comic book store and pick up comic books without picking up some Batman. I mean, so, you are the doctor. I am of the doctor Batman. of Batman. And if I ever go to a comic store and I don't pick up Batman, and the only reason I wouldn't pick up Batman is I already have all the issues, or they don't have any Batman issues, you need to, you need to call my doctor. This is uh, Batman versus Big B. I don't know what this story is. I'm going to check this out. This is DC's Black Label. So this is their more adult kind of content, and it's got more darker, more, it's a lot more cool. It's, it's really, it's, a, you know, it's their more adult sort of story. Story is not, you know, it's not, it's like PG, it's like PG-18 or whatever. Not necessarily rated R. Uh, and then I got the Batman, uh, Batman number 493. This is part of the Nightfall storyline, which just the other day I got the... Uh, the, the this is the storyline where we're introduced to Bane. It's not in this book, but in the storyline, the Nightfall storyline, and, and this is kind of the lead up to that, these issues. I have, uh, Bane sending, just sending several different villains after Batman and worrying them out, and eventually he breaks Batman's back. And that leads us to Batman number 500. This is after Batman... His uh, back is broken, and then he has to basically, later on, uh, earlier he has back broken, so he had to ask, this is Asriel, he had to ask Asriel to uh, basically cover for him as Batman, and Asriel is much more violent. And this is the issue where Asriel beats, the, beats Bane, and he whips Bane's ass. But, you know, later, you know, the, the Batman basically has to take back over, because Asriel is just, he's ruthless, man, he's ruthless. And this, of course, obviously a landmark issue, because it's number 500. Uh, but that's this week's haul, man. And I'm really excited to go take these home and read all of them. That's pretty cool. Reread some of them.